doing? Don't think. Shoot. Shoot, motherfucker. Shoot! Don't talk to me like a rookie! I'm telling you, shoot! Straight at her ass. That's all. Okay. Who are you? Uh. You fool! You, you've killed him. I'm sorry, sir. This mental shielding was very strong. I could not dive into his mind. Now we'll never get that detonation code. Oh yeah, there's a lot of things to do before the wall here. What? This is cool. <laughs> what does that have to do with anything? <laughs> I love that. Okay, you fucking pedophile, or not pedophile, but uh, stalker, I don't know, womanizer, whatever you want to call it. He's like, oh shit. Naomi, I just had some kind of hallucination. Is it from the nanomachines? No, Snake, the nanomachines are functioning properly. So what was it? It must have been psychometric interference coming from Psychomantis, Foxhound Psychic. Think of it as a mental feedback loop. So that was Mantis. Crazy asshole. Yay, dead guy. Yay, naked guy. Who doesn't get up because he's naked, because... They don't want to show shit, I guess. Okay, nothing under her bed. Damn it. What about over here? Blah, blah. Yep, more ammo. Ammo's always good. Can I open up? I can't open up lockers yet. I can't remember how to open up lockers. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Okay. Oh well, whatever. It happens. Yay, I have level one card. Wait a minute. Do I have full ration? Okay. My life bar went up a little bit. Yay. Yeah. Yeah, Psycho Mantis is awesome. Because he is like the character that breaks the fourth wall all the fucking time. Okay, let's go to B2. Why not? Okay, before I, before I keep going, I'm going to save this shit. Damn it, fucking controls. Okay, there we go. What the 
What's up, Snake? What's up, Snake? Well, I don't know. I just want to save my fucking games. Snake, listen to what Lo Chi said. He who knows that enough is enough will always have enough. Just because you see an item doesn't mean that you always have to get yeah, it. Yeah, it does. If you don't really need it, think twice before you stick your neck out. It might not be worth it. Might it might not be worth it. Okay, thanks for the advice. I'm sorry, that was a very racist thing. It might not be worth it. Why am I using this? Because there's traps in this place and you can see them with thermal goggles. Like that! Do you see that? That's a fucking trap. They actually let you see the traps in this game, which is pretty cool. And there's another fucking trap. I'm just gonna slide across. Because you can't outrun the traps in this game. That's probably why they let you see them. One. Going to crawl on the ground. C4, yeah, I got some C4, motherfucker. The reason I'm crawling is because in some rooms they put mines. On, yeah, mines. Another trap. Can't go in there yet. Crawling on the ground because I know they like putting mines in places like this. Silk on bullets. Oh, I'm full on bullets. So I guess I'm gonna have to shoot them. Although, if there are mines. Oh, yeah, you can't go in here yet because I don't have level 4 yet. Grenades, yeah, grenades are awesome. There, there's a really cool boss fight that you use grenades for. should look slightly different. Look at the walls carefully in first-person view mode. Try to find the walls that have a different pattern. Did you try hitting the wall? Maybe it'll sound different too. Those C4 explosives you've got should be able to destroy the walls that were cemented over. God damn it, I didn't mean to call them again. The walls that were... Yeah, possibly. Let's see what Master has to say. Snake, you've got to think. Your mind is your most dangerous weapon. If things are getting too complicated, try to simplify your thoughts. You can also try calling Campbell for advice. Call you to... Call you so you can tell me to call someone else for advice? Yay, that's awesome. Okay. Well, I know where the... I know where it is. It's right fucking here. Like here, I'll even nod. And the C4 in this game, I actually know how to use it, yeah. Yeah. Why couldn't they do this in the other two games? Press square to set plus press circle to detonate. How fucking easy is that? They couldn't do that in the first two games? Oh yeah. Okay. So calm. Ready? 
President Baker should be somewhere around there. Hurry up and find him. Also, you can't use your radar there. Mei says it's because of electronic jamming. If you want to know more, ask her. Well, maybe I want to know more then, goddammit. Snake, you can't use your radar in that area. There's some kind of... So you basically told me the same thing the Colonel did. I wonder wow. what it is. Anyway, be careful. Well, she said, I wonder what it is. That's something different, I guess. <laughs> By the way, even though I'm saying all this stuff, don't get me wrong, this game is one of the best games ever made, so don't don't think I'm hating on the game. I'm not. Be careful, It's Snake. an amazing fucking game, so. There's actually two spots where you can load charges. Okay, that's the boss room, not going in there yet. Because I'm pretty sure there's some stuff in here. Oh yeah, that gun shoots at you. But I can get this. I'm gonna die. Yeah, you can't go in either of those doors yet. Oh, and there's a ration over there, too. Dude, am I full on ration? But I don't have full life now. Oh, well. Okay. So, this is a good spot to save again. I know I've been saving a lot, but this is a good spot to save because it's right before the boss fight, so... Snake, you can't use your radar in that yeah, area. Yeah, I know. Fuck you. Be careful, Snake. God, it's better when she gets her dialogues. So, as, as you can see... Yeah, so this is where you get him, so... This fight is pretty fun, actually. Am I too late, motherfucker? He's alive. You're the arms tech president, Kenneth Baker, right? Don't worry. I'm here to save you. No, no, don't touch it! C4. Damn, he has pretty good reactions. Right. Touch that wire, and the C4 will blow up along with the old man. So you're the one that the boss keeps talking about. And you? Special Operations Foxhound. Revolver Ocelot. I've been waiting for you, Solid Snake. Now we'll see if the man can live up to the legend. This is the greatest handgun ever made. The Colt's single action army. Six bullets, more than enough to kill anything that moves. Now I'll show you why they call me... Revolver. Hiding won't help. 
This fight is easy once you figure out how to do it. You basically just uh, train your gun on it. That's the big thing. Probably shouldn't talk so much. Dumb shit. I love the smell of boredom. You know, that's so good. Yeah, like I said, you shouldn't talk so much, asshole. But to you, be the smell of your own death. Yeah, see that this you're, fight you're is harder good. when you don't know how to Just do it. Just what I expect from the man with the same code as the boss. It's been a long time since I had such a good fight, but I'm just getting warmed up. What? My hand! No way you can run away when you're losing that much blood. <laughs> Get the suppressor from. They must have assumed that you already got it. Can you talk? Who are you? I'm not one of them. The DARPA chief told me he gave them his detonation code. What about yours? Oh, I get it. Jim sent you. You're, you're from the Pentagon. Answer my question. What about your code? There's no time. I talked. What? Now the terrorists have both codes and can launch any time. I love this It's not like I didn't fight. I managed to resist Psycho Mantis's mind probe. He couldn't read you? How'd you do it? Surgical implants in my brain. Surgical implants? Kind of like a psychic insulation. Everyone who knows these top secret codes has it. Even the DARPA chief? Of course. But the DARPA chief said Mantis got his code by reading his mind. Are you sure you heard him right? Yeah, sure. In that case, how did they get your code? I never had any training on how to resist torture. <laughs> it looks like he had some fun with you, all right. Oh, he's not human. I tell you, he loved every second of it. What happened to your arm? He broke it. Looks like you're more than even now. His was sliced off. Ha, huh. you're a funny man. So the DARPA chief, is he okay? Dead. What? I can't be. No, no, that's not what you promised, Jim. Now you want to shut me up. <laughs> Calm down. What's wrong with you? Calm I just told you I was here to save you. I didn't kill the DARPA chief. He had a heart attack or something. A heart attack? Oh, don't be a fool. Anyway, the terrorists have both codes now. Those boys are totally insane. They wouldn't hesitate to launch. I agree. But what do they really want? Oh, who knows? Maybe they're like us in the arms industry. Always looking forward to the next good war. 
Well, I'm not gonna let these maniacs start a war today. You still have the card keys. Card keys? To override the detonation code. I heard you had them. No, not anymore. What? Who does then? Not the terrorists. No, that woman. Woman? Who? A soldier that was thrown in There's prison. There's only one woman on this Female entire soldier. base. It must be. She said she had just joined up as a new recruit. They threw her in prison because she refused to take part in the rebellion. A new recruit? Could that be the colonel's niece? I gave her the key. Looks like she managed to break out of here, though. I hope she's okay. I'm sure she is. She's green, but as tough as they come. But how did you know she escaped? I was in contact with her by Kodak. Until I was tied up here, that is. Kodak? Yes. She stole it from the guard. If she still has it, you should be able to contact her. I'm sure she still has it. What frequency was she at? Oh, yeah. Let me tell you, it's... Now, her codec is actually oh, on the back of the, sorry, the box forgot. of this game. Damn. But I wrote it down before I brought the disc. Oh, that's there. right. It should be on the back yep. of the CD case. Try to contact like her. Said. I'll contact her right away. But tell me, if this doesn't work, is there some other way to prevent the missile launch? You need to find Hal Emmerich, one of my employees. Who's that? Hal Emmerich the becomes leader, the, the big part of the story. Project. A genius in engineering, but a little bit of an oddball. If there's anyone who can figure out how to stop Metal Gear from launching, it's him. What if he can't come up with anything? You'll have to destroy it. Emmerich knows how to destroy Metal Gear. Where is this Emmerich? Well, he's probably being held somewhere in the nuclear warhead storage building. It's north from here. That's where he worked. I understand, but why Metal Gear? The nuclear age ended with the turn of the millennium. Oh, you're wrong. The threat of nuclear war isn't gone. In fact, it's greater than it's ever been. The amount of spent nuclear fuel and plutonium is increasing even today. Listen, have you ever seen a warehouse full of nuclear material? No. Drums and drums of nuclear waste stack this high, as far as you can see. Because there's still no real way to dispose of the stuff. So they just close the lid and try to pretend like it'll go away? Uh, essentially, yes. And they're not even doing a good job of storing it. Many of the drums are corroded, with nuclear waste seeping out of them. Unbelievable. Not only that, but several pounds of muff are reported every year. Muff? It stands for material unaccounted for. It proves that there's a large and well-organized black market in nuclear materials. Furthermore, since the end of the Cold War, Russian nuclear engineers in particular are out of work with no way to turn. In other words, there's plenty of available nuclear material this game really scientists does for making have, a bomb. Have a good way we live in an age when any small nuclear. country can have a nuclear weapons program. What about the other superpowers? Russia and China still maintain a significant nuclear presence. Complete nuclear disarmament is an impossibility. I agree with to that. To maintain our own policy of deterrence, we need a weapon of overwhelming power. Metal Gear. You mean Metal Gear? Yes. You know our industry suffered quite a blow as a result of the cuts in military budgets due to this so-called peace. I remember hearing a lot about mergers and takeover makers. Yes, and after my company lost their bid to produce the Air Force's next line of fighter jet, the Metal Gear system was our last ace in the hole. That's why we pushed to have Metal Gear developed as a black project. Black project? Secret projects paid for by the Pentagon's black budget. You can avoid a lot of red tape and get a great lead time I don't know if that's production. true, but and no one I'm sure it is. Not even those bleeding sure heart he liberals on the military right. oversight committee. There's probably more than one kind of budget the Pentagon Rhymes. has. I prefer to think of it as good business. Anyway, Metal Gear was going to be formally adopted after the results of this exercise were analyzed. I don't give a crap about you and your company. Yes, that's about what I'd expect from a grunt like you. Here, th this is what you came for, right? What's that? An optical disc. It's all here. The main hard drive was destroyed by gunfire. This is the only remaining copy of the data. What kind of data? All the data collected from this exercise. Don't play dumb. 
I know you were sent to get this. I hid it from that sadistic maniac while he was torturing me. Where? They don't know the sadistic exists. Make sure you report this to Jim. To your boss. And you might be Looking wondering my who is Jim? Too. You'll find out. It'll open up all security level two doors. Can you walk? No. No, you go on without me. They got my password. They don't want anything else from me. I have one more question. Who or what was that ninja thing? It looked like you knew something. That ninja? That was Foxhound's dark little secret. Dark little secret? An experimental genome soldier. <coughs> you know him? You should ask Dr. Naomi Hunter from Foxhound. She knows better than I. Naomi. You've got to stop them. If it goes public, my company and I are finished. What? Doesn't Metal Gear use currently existing technology? Metal Gear itself does, but... What? What did you do to me? Oh, no! Oh, oh no, it can't be! By the way, the Those Pentagon bastards! So, they, they actually went in, did it! What are you talking about? They, they, they are just using you for... That part of the story doesn't get revealed till almost the end, so I'm not going to ruin it either. <laughs> what the hell? <sighs> Colonel, are you listening? Now he's dead too. I have no idea. Don't lie to me. It looked like another heart attack, but... Some kind of poison? Well, there are lots of drugs that can cause a heart attack in large doses. For example, potassium chloride or dioxides, but we won't be able to tell without doing an autopsy. Damn! Snake, I want you and Meryl to work together. Can I trust her? More than you can trust me. <laughs> Get in contact with her. Snake, there's a lot of electrical interference coming from there. It should be okay if you do burst transmission like us, but normal transmission is probably impossible. Try moving away from that area. Snake, get a hold of yourself. Naomi, what the hell was that ninja thing? Remember a foxhound? No. Are you sure? Yes, we have no one like that in our unit. Is that right? Snake, I'm counting on you. Actually, she knows exactly who it is, but... Goddamn asshole! Why'd you have to go and die on me, fucker? Can I crouch next to him? Okay. Oh, sad day. Some old rich bastard died. Alright, guys. Um, I'm going... We are getting very close to the two-hour mark. I'm going to take a break because I've been playing this game for almost two hours, so. Um, I am going to take a break, but when I come back, I will continue the epic saga that is Metal Gear Solid, which is an amazing fucking game. Snake, you can't use your radar in that area. Yeah, 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 fuck you. Be careful, Snake. That's all she has to say. Anyways, guys, I'm going to take a break. Uh, when I come back, we will continue the epic saga that is Metal Gear Solid. I hope you guys want to watch and stick around. So thanks for watching, and I will see you guys on the next stream. Yeah. Snake! Snake!